you are already subscribed if you're not then please subscribe i'm going to be doing these videos weekly i also do another food content video weekly and that is the meals that we've had in the week so if you do want to follow please hit that subscribe button but this is going to be a food shopping haul from asda it is currently earlier on in the day just because i wanted the natural light i do get this food shopping delivered later on in the night when the children are in bed that's just how i find it easiest so at the end of this video i'm going to be letting you know how much it has cost altogether and also the meals of the week as well for the up and coming week so this is a food shop for a family of four there's me my husband my three-year-old girl and my 15 month little boy i hope you enjoy before i start this food shop i just want to say that i've noticed that four items are missing from my delivery and unfortunately they are all of the meat well pretty much all of the meat so i'm missing some sausages which i have got some in the freezer so that's not too bad but the bacon, prawns and the beef that I ordered are totally missing so I've had to ask for a refund from Asda. Here's a quick overview of it all and I'll just talk you through it now. So to start off with like household and toiletries I've got this really big bottle of fairy. Also some more black bags as we needed them. And some deodorant for myself, two bottles of Coke Zero, and then here is a bit like a Christmas sort of section, a Christmas present section. So I've just got some Yorkshire tea, but this is the multi biscuit flavour. If you haven't tried this before, it literally tastes like you're dunking biscuits in tea. It is really, really nice. So I'm putting that in a hamper. Um, also, I bought a couple of mugs separately, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these um, mini marshmallows in the mugs, and then a selection of hot chocolates as well, just as like a little present for some, well, for a couple of people. Here as well, for a little hamper to go with the biscuit tea, I got some clotted cream fudge. And also a giant chocolate coin as well. I've got a tin of biscuits. This is another present. And then moving on to here are the fruit. So I've got a pineapple at the back, two seedless red grapes. Me and my husband both snack on these. When we're feeling a little bit peckish, we just grab a handful out of the fridge. Also, two lots of bananas as they're a favourite in this house. I've really been enjoying these um, easy peelers, um, just little oranges basically. Um, so I've been having those recently. So I've got some more of those. Some little apples for the children, bigger apples for me and my husband. Some kiwis and this won't last us all week. We probably will go out about Friday and get a bit of a top up of fruit as well. Moving on to the vegetables and the salad section, I've got two cucumbers, I like to chop this up for my children to snack on, some carrots, some peppers, red onions, spinach, I like to add this to, into a lot of meals, this is really good for you, two lots of Mary's Piper potatoes, some shredded iceberg lettuce and some sweet leaf and carrot salad. And some baby plum tomatoes. And fun fact, this was my craving obsession when I was pregnant with my little boy. So Cheerios for my little girl. She, that's it. This is our, her favourite cereal. Some King's Mill 50-50. Moving on to like the snacks sort of section. So we don't buy a lot of snacks in just because if they're here, we will eat them. And we're both trying to be really good. But we have got some pom bears for the children and a couple of packets of snacker jacks as well. You get three for £3.50 in Asda. Again, for the children, I've just picked up these brioche swirl chocolate chip ones. These were a substitute. I did order the raisin ones, but my children are going to like them regardless. Come on, they're chocolate chip. So they'll be happy. Chocolate, hazelnut, um crepes 
I can't say that word, basically your pancake with chocolate in them. Again, for snacks or to go along with their breakfast. So moving on to here, this is like the meat and fish section. So I've just got a big multi-pack, it's really heavy actually, of chicken breasts. I will just portion these out and freeze them. Oh my gosh, that is so heavy. <laughs> Um, again, a big lean statement. This is less than 5% fat. And then chorizo. I've just got a twin pack of chorizo. I'm just going to freeze this and I'm going to use it in a meal for next Monday. And some sandwich fillers basically. So Bavarian style ham. Sorry about the light. You get three for four pounds. Some extra tasty chicken breasts and some char grill chicken as well. So we just snack on those or have those in sandwiches. These little 10 mini flipper dippers. So they're a bit like um, obviously fish fingers but shaped as fish. So I'm sure the children will love those. We do have a fast food Friday so this will be like a treat for them on a Friday night. These were substituted. I did order chicken Christmas tree shapes, but they changed them. They substituted them to sticky chicken skewers. I mean, we'll eat them anyway, I'm sure. This is like the tin section. So I've just got some chopped tomatoes and two lots of baked beans. We do go through baked beans a lot in this house. I just find them really filling. Also, I just picked up a few tins of really quick last minute lunches for the children so there's two macaroni cheese and two spaghetti bolognese they can have this with toast if we're in a rush some tuna and some garlic granules and then lastly we've got the dairy so just some 12 free range medium eggs some baby bell which i'm going to be using partly for a recipe this week floralite 50 percent less less fat mature grated cheese i've got some more lighter than light mayonnaise and a green top and a blue top milk for my little boy Moving on now to next week's meal plan. So next Monday, before the food shopping arrives, Monday night, I'm gonna be using that chorizo to make chicken and chorizo red pepper pasta. Tuesday, which is tomorrow, sorry to confuse you, but tomorrow we're having prawn cocktail salad and jacket potatoes. Wednesday, we're having chicken, and cheese wrapped in bacon. So I'm gonna pop a baby bell inside the chicken and then wrap it in bacon. And we're having that with spinach, mash and carrots. Thursday is chili and rice. It's a firm favorite in this house. It's my little girl's absolute favorite. Friday is a fast food Friday. So the children will probably have those fish dippers and we might get a takeaway. Saturday is beef mayflower curry and rice. Children will probably have plain beef rice. And Sunday we're having sausage, egg, chips and beans. And I've got sausages in the freezer. So that is my weekly food grocery haul. That is my weekly meal plan for the up and coming week. If you did like this video, please give me a subscribe and a thumbs up. I'm gonna do these every week for you. <laughs> Thank you.